This week's review gun is one that I've been hoping to get my hands on since I first clocked it at the Iowa show in Germany back in March. It's the Cometer Orion BP, the ballpup version of the Orion that we tested just a few weeks ago. And just like its stablemate, it's very well priced. This one has a price tag of £599. The wooden stock is finished in black which gives a very tactical look especially when combined with its stubby proportions and that very distinctive fore-end grip. The angle of the grip can be adjusted at the press of a button to accommodate various holes. It's attached via an accessory rail so it can be removed or even replaced with a bipod or laser. Another standout stock feature is the rubberized drop-down pistol grip. It's contoured for a very comfortable hold and its soft touch stippled finish feels great in the hand. Its sculpted profile makes for a very good fit and gives brilliant trigger attack. There's even some storage space in there, which you access via a sliding cover at the base. The Compact Orion BP measures around 70 centimetres and tips the scales at just over four kilos unscoped. It does feel a little hefty, but should still be manageable for shooters of most sizes. Overall handling is generally pretty good, although with a little more sculpting around the areas in contact with the shoulder and cheek, it would be even better. The metalwork is finished to a tidy standard, and I particularly like the fact that most of it has a matte, anti-glare finish to prevent any telltale flashes in the field. One thing to be mindful of is the Picatinny type scope rail. You're going to need to make sure you've got the right mounts to fit it. The cold hammer forged barrel, made in Cometa's own factory in Spain, should ensure decent accuracy. The chunky barrel shroud comes fitted and, apart from looking good, also does a reasonable job of stifling muzzle report. To fill the Orion BP, remove the cap from the front of the cylinder and connect to the quick fill inlet. A 200 bar fill gives more than 150 shots at close to the UK legal limit. There's a gauge on the underside of the stock to give a clear visual indication of air reserves. The 2.2 calibre BP has a 13 shot magazine and the 177 has a 17 shot mag. Just like with the SPR, you load it with the clear plate facing away from you, loading pellets tail end first and turning the plate clockwise to reveal another chamber for each pellet. When it's fully loaded, you return the plate back to its original position and it's good to go. The sturdy rear bolt cycles smoothly, but is still robust enough to cope with heavy-handed use. Its action cocks the gun, cycles the magazine and probes home the next pellet. And because the rear of the magazine is clear, it's easy to keep an eye on how many pellets you've got left. The BP's trigger is a two-stage adjustable unit. The blade has a very pronounced curve to it and its wide front edge gives plenty of feel. The first stage is very short, but the second stage is still predictable, so I haven't messed about with it. Like on the SPR version, the safety catch is located just in front of the trigger, which I don't think is the safest place to put it. Nonetheless, it is very positive. You draw it back to make the gun safe and then push it forwards when you're ready to fire. So, that's a quick whiz through the Cometer Orion BP's key features. Let's put it to the test on some paper. Well, we've got a very light breeze today, but still managed a ragged group of about half an inch at 25 metres. Now, it's not going to win you any matches, but that's perfectly good enough accuracy for hunting out to mid-range. Now, the gun did that today using Bisley Magnum pellets, but I dare say if we experimented with some others, we could probably even tighten it up a little bit more. So, if you're in the market for a bullpup PCP, the Cometer Orion BP is well worth a look. 
And coming in at under £600, it's certainly one of the more affordable ones out there. And that price includes a neat hard case. But the Orion BP doesn't feel like a cheap air gun. It's solidly built, boasts some great features, and it's a decent performer. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.